Hi guys, it's the Dark Horse here, and I'm bringing you my first Battlefield Hardline commentary, video, montage, murder spree, whatever. Man, wow, you don't know how many times I tried recording this. This is like, what, my sixth time trying to record this? Because the first time, it was just some simple mistakes. I, well, no, it was me being stupid. I was just pressing buttons on my PS controller. And um, I hit the back button and kind of deleted it. But the last time I tried to record, I recorded, I talked, I recorded a whole video for 13 minutes, right? The, the song was video is like 13, 27. But anyway, yeah, I recorded a video for 13 minutes. And then guess what I did? Instead of pressing the S, it's X. Instead of pressing the X, it clearly said stop. It clearly said stop. I pressed the circle button and all the footage, well not footage, all my voice recording is gone. So now I have to do this all over again for you guys. What I do for YouTube, right? Anyway, hi, hello, the Dark Horse here. And um, yeah, Battlefield Heartline video. I got this game for my B-Day, which is Monday, June 29th. Um, yeah, I got this game for my B-Day along, B-Day, B-Day, along with Minecraft. So, um, yeah, that's pretty fun, pretty fun. What? I got this game for my birthday, along with Minecraft. And, um, yeah, so, I said some Minecraft videos coming for you guys. Just give me a heads up for Minecraft videos. Anyway. Yeah, so better for Heartland. I like this game. It really is. I, 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 I like this game. It really is. Yep. English. Anyway, yeah, I like this game. It really is fun. It's really fun. It's non stop action, non stop funness. Non stop funness. Yep, that makes sense. Anyway, um, yeah, so basically, what I'm doing right now, I'm doing blood money, which is basically what you have to do. You have to take money from a vault. Well, not a vault, from a, from a money pile and put it in your vault. Or you can steal money from the enemy team and put it in your vault also. So basically, you're the cops and the criminals. That's what all of Heartline is about, cops and criminals. The war on crime. Because you know how Battlefield is like a war game? Well, they did Battle for Heartline as a war on crime. Basically, so it's cops and robbers, cops versus robbers. And then, so you have the cops are trying to take the money as evidence. You are there to recover money as evidence. So the cops are trying to get the money as evidence, and the robbers are getting money for themselves. Because, what? I said the cops. The cops are getting money as evidence, and the criminals are getting money for that. The, did I say criminals? I don't know what I said. Anyway, yeah, so that's basically what I'm doing right now. Um, I'm doing this over... I've basically been doing a lot of blood money recently, because I just... I think it's, I think it gives you more money than any other game mode in Battlefield. Heartline. Um, yeah, that, the other game modes are fun, don't get me wrong. They're really fun, like Hotwire, um, Heist, Conquest, Large and Small. They have this thing called, what, re recipe? No, that is, uh, they do, but I, they, they have this thing called Crosshair. This is basically, you are a, you're the criminals, or the cops, and so you have to get a VIP to a, to a, you, have, you basically have to let the VIP escape the area before the criminals kill them, because the criminals don't like the VIP. So they're, they're trying to kill the VIP. So basically what they're doing is, the cops have to get them to the, to the escort vehicle, and the criminals want, I have to try to stop them from getting there. And um, they also have this thing called rescue, which is basically the same thing, but in the co <laughs> oh excuse me, how rude, soda rude. Anyway, soda. That's what I had to make me burp. <laughs> the analogy. Again, burp. Excuse me, my bad. Any hoops, basketball goal. Anyway, um, yeah. So what we <laughs> rescue? Yeah, you're a cop, and you have to rescue a hostage from a criminal. That's, that's basically it. That's really all. This too. Yeah. Anyway, yeah, so I like this game though. Um, I've never actually owned a Battlefield game before in my life. I played the betas like Battlefield 4 and Hardline, but I've never actually owned a Battlefield game, so it kind of took me a while to like understand the mechanics and all. Like, understand that I have more than two weapons. <laughs> like, I have, a, I have a primary weapon, secondary weapon, and a gadget. So, like, I have to get used to the D pass. Like, wait a minute. What does this do? I have a grappling hook? Holy balls. I have an ammo pack off health? What? So much, more than, so much more than Call of Duty? Yeah, so, yeah, I did get used to that. Um, also, I would like to point out, I, I think I prefer Battlefield over Call of Duty. Actually, no, I don't think I know. I rather prefer Battlefield over Call of Duty. I personally like Battlefield more than Call of Duty. Um, just for the simple fact, pack fact, just for the, just for the simple fact that they give you more freedom, there's more stuff to do. Like, in Call of Duty, I, they get, first of all, the maps are already quite tiny. They're, they're quite small. Ain't rubbish. Um, yeah, they're they're small, and I'm not 
I'm not the person for small maps. I like big open battlefields, you know, that's why I like battlefield. Um one thing though, one thing that I didn't like with what they did what they did with Heartline, they took out they, eh, they took out the damage module. They took out the damage mechanic. They took out how you could damage things. There we go. English. They they took out how you could damage things. Like you remember how in Battlefield four and three and two and Bad Company and so on. They had where you can destroy buildings for fun, like just just like a random building, just put a hole in it, with see for no apparent reason at all. You can't do this in Heartline. Um, there are certain places you can they can be destroyed, like here where the money is, like the walls can be destroyed, like there are holes in the wall, and that's about it. Like some fences can be destroyed, you know, of course glass can be destroyed, but like the buildings and the walls, you can't really destroy stuff, which I, which I didn't like what they did, you know, I. Visceral why, but yeah, I kind of preferred it where you could destroy stuff because I'm I don't know why I, I, I just like destruction. I don't know. I just really like destruction. I don't know what is it with me. I just like destruction um, But yeah, so you can't you can't destroy as much things as you could do in battlefield But it's still a battlefield like you still have a revolution crap so you can level evolution and there's one map I think it's called down. Yeah, it is called downtown like I don't know how you destroy the crane I don't know how you do that only thing I know is a crane falls and everything gets destroyed like like a giant like just imagine a giant crane you're like you're like in the city and a giant crane just like falls down and destroys everything that's i, I, I like that. that's like the best evolution in battlefield i like it why am i snapping so much like, snapper <laughs> anyway so um, yeah happy fourth of july guys happy fourth of july well happy fifth of july because it is 12 almost one o'clock in the morning why do I record my video so late? Who knows? No, nobody knows. Yep. But anyway, yeah, happy 4th of July. Probably too late for that. It is too late for that. I know for a fact that it's too late. Why did I say probably if I know for a <laughs> Anyway. Um, yeah. So. Um, what'd you guys do for your 4th of July? Um, what what I do? I, we grilled a lot of food. We grilled like a whole bunch of food. It's what, it's what we did. <laughs> that's exactly what we did. Yeah, we grilled a whole bunch of food and my grandma came up here. To spend the whole July with us, so that's pretty fun. And um, yeah, so we grew a whole bunch of food, and um, we attempted to go see fireworks. A attempted. Uh, yeah. Well, we did see fireworks, but we had to try two times. Like the first time we tried to do it, and the world said try again, and we, you know, went to see fireworks like, again. Like anyway, anyway. So yeah. Um, basically, what happened was we went. We just moved to this. We just moved to this area, so we don't know where far we're gonna be at. Well, we know where far we're gonna be at. Just that we didn't want to travel too far from our house, cause who wants to travel far? I like traveling. Just I don't want to do it now. <laughs> Not now. Anyway, so yeah, so we were informed that the horse park was giving um was shooting fireworks. It was like, all right, let's go to the horse park. You know, let's go there and watch fireworks. So we were like, all right, let's go to the horse park. You know, me, me being, you know, dark horse, you know, I'm from a horse fan, you know? Gotta see horse squad, squad. You know, can't let down horse park, man. man. You can't do that, you can't do this like that. You can't do this like that. Anyway, anyway, yeah, so we went to the horse park. Um, We all went there and um, the place was basically a, a mystery. Uh, it, was, well, it was confusing there, basically what I'm trying to say. The place was just super confusing. Like, when we turned, when we turned into the lot, let me rephrase that. When we turned into the area, into a gravel area, we just saw cars there. Oh yeah, by the way guys, look at this clip. This is pure luck right here. Look at that. Boom! That headshot in the moving vehicle with the sniper. Knowing my sniping skills, I can't do that on a normal. Okay? That's just luck. Okay? That was Battlefield saying, you know what? This guy sucks at sniping. Let's, let's just give him something good to put on his video. So I'm like, thank you, Visceral. Thank you, Battlefield. Thank you. You know? Yeah. Anyway, so back to the story. So we turned into this gravel area. We were like, and we saw cars there. Well, basically, basically what we're doing. We're just driving around until we saw, until we saw civilization, because we were just driving down a long road, like a really long road that we didn't know where anything was. So yeah, so we drove down this long road, and so we found ourselves civilization. So we went to civilization. So apparently they were there for fireworks too. So so we turned into this weird lot thing. I never even called it a parking lot because there weren't any lines there to show where you could park. There was nothing. There was just a big open area with gravel that you could park there. So people just park anywhere really. 
we just parked with, like on the side of another vehicle. So yeah, so we waited there for like ten seconds until we asked them like what was going on. Cause people were there, they were just standing around. Like they everybody there everybody there looked confused. Like they were just all they all had this confused face, like like why are we here? <laughs> like what is this place? Why are we here? What is life? What is the meaning of life? Anyway, yeah, so we got there, everybody face was confused, so we're like, What's going on? And then so my mother got out to ask a lady who was who seemed to know everything. But anyway, yeah, so this lady, she was, she was just standing there. She was telling people what, what what was going down. So my mom went over there, and so she came back with the face with of like total just what's the what's the word? I can't think of English words right now. What's the word? Disappointment. There we go. So I'm like, yo, what what happened? Fam, what's wrong? She was like, <laughs> yeah, she was like, no fireworks. I was like. Say that, say, say that again. No, no fireworks. She's like no fireworks. I'm just like. No fireworks. I don't know about you guys. I like fireworks. I really personally enjoy fireworks. I like I don't like the sound it makes. I like the sonic waves thumping against me. What that that sounds. That sounds weird. <laughs> the so I like the sound of waves thumping. Get no, I, I, I like the sound of it. So I like the thumping and like the pretty colors and <laughs> your pretty colors. Rainbow. Anyway, so yeah, I like I really like fireworks. So I was like, you know, I was all hyped for fireworks. You know, I gotta get hype for stuff that I like. Gotta get hype for stuff that I like. That's terrible. I can't rap. I'm supposed to be how rich? Supposed to be black. Anyway, um, yeah, so I was hyped for fireworks and no fireworks. I was like, really? So I went around to ask some people, like, do you know where any other fireworks would be? Because I want to see some fireworks. And it's the 4th of July, too. I want to see some freaking fireworks. We could have been a storm mountain, but I don't want to go to storm mountain. Simply for the main fact, because it's the 4th of July. And you know, a lot of people are going to be in storm mountain. And it was already like nine something by the time we got there. By, by the time we got to the horse park, we were lost. So yeah, so there was no way in the world we were going to Stone Mountain at nine o'clock on 4th of July. There's no way. There's gonna be too many people there. Probably couldn't find a parking spot. And, by the, and if we did find a parking spot, it would take us like an hour to get there because nine o'clock at Stone Mountain, no. But anyway, so yeah, so we were informed that there was gonna be fireworks at other location. So we drove, I put in GPS, we drove there, and yeah, we just drove that sort of fireworks there. So when we got, yeah, basically, <laughs> it's basically, yeah, we, we went there. It took us a while, it took, took them a while for them to start it though, because like, they fired some, and then they waited like 10 minutes to, to fire some more. But bottom line, we saw fireworks. I was a happy camper, my family was a happy camper, pretty sure everybody else was a happy camper. We were all happy campers. We had marshmallows, we had tents, we had lanterns. But we were getting their own camping, dude. We had, we took, we were telling ghost stories. We had a campfire. I'm telling Anyway, thank you guys for watching this video. Please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. I said that, I said that right, why did I stop? You retard, why did you stop? You said that correctly this time. The one time you say English correctly and you, and you stop. You stop when you don't speak English. Harvest, you gotta learn these things. Anyway, thank you guys for watching this video. Please leave a like, a comment, and subscribe if you want more of me commentating stuff and gameplay and other stuff and montages and stuff, what's to come. Anyway, yeah. Also, um, just let you know if you're still listening now, just always remember.